constant function constant is a function function is a function like this is the graph ko agar hum dekhe to that is always parallel to the x axis like this suppose it is a function fx is equal to c where c is any constant value suppose it is 4 5 or so on so that function is known as the constant function so it means a function that assigns the same value to every member of its domain isko agar hum define karenge to that will be the definition a function that assigns the same value to every member of its domain is called constant function it means domain means the values of x as values of x is changing the value of y is not changing it is constant so such functions are known as the constant function so it is a simple graph of a constant function after that the second type of function is the absolute value function absolute value function absolute value function is also known as the modulus function it is also known as the modulus function and in the symbolic form it is represented as y is equal to absolute value x or mod of x it is defined in two parts y is equal to mod of x it will be equal to x when x is greater than or equal to 0 and minus x when x is less than 0 this function is very important not only for competitive examinations but also to solve the questions of limit continuity and differentiability which are asked in the competitive examinations so इसका ग्राफ को अगर हम देखें तो दैट विल बी इन टू पार्ट्स लाइक दिस इट विल बी इन टू क्वेंटेंट्स दिस पार्ट ऑफ द ग्राफ रिप्रेजेंट्स वाई इज इक्वल टू एक्स एंड दिस पार्ट रिप्रेजेंट्स वाई इज इक्वल टू माइनस एक्स so it is for x is greater than equal to 0 and it is for x is less than 0 so y is equal to x if we compare this uh, equation with the equation of a straight line so we can see that it is a straight line passing through the origin y is equal to mx so is tarah se samajh sakte hain to that this angle will be also 45 degree similarly this angle will be also 45 degree so it is the modulus function it is also important for competitive examinations now the third type third type of function is the greatest integer function
greatest integer function is also known as step point function because it is defined in steps इसको हम स्टेप्स में डिफाइन कर सकते हैं तो इट्स ग्राफ कैन बी शोन लाइक दिस सपोज इट इज वन टू थ्री इट इज ऑल्सो वन टू थ्री अलॉन्ग बाई एक्सेस सो द फंक्शन विल बी लाइक दिस इट इज डिफाइंड इन स्टेप्स these circles represents that here the function is not defined so it is defined in steps alag alag steps will define hoga minus 1 minus 2 and so on so such type of function is known as the greatest integer function. Now the symbol for greatest integer function is fx is equal to greatest integer of x. This symbol is always used. Or if we look at definition, then in generalized way that definition will be equal to it is equal to 0 when x lies between 0 and 1. यहां ग्राफ से देख सकते हैं जीरो से वन के बीच में इसकी वैल्यू जीरो है फिर वन से टू के बीच में इसकी वैल्यू वन रहेगी तो इट इज इक्वल टू वन वन एक्स लाइज बिटवीन वन एंड टू इट इज टू वन एक्स लाइज बिटवीन टू एंड थ्री एंड सो ऑन तो इट इज द ग्रेटेस्ट इंटीचर फंक्शन नॉ नेक्स्ट टाइप इज द सिग्नम फंक्शन In short form, it is written as y is signum of x, and it has only three values minus 1, 0, and plus 1. It is minus 1 when x is less than 0, it is 0 when x is 0, and it is 1 when x is greater than 1. So, its graph can be drawn like this it is your x axis, it is y axis. So it will assign only three values like this. So its value is 1 when x is greater than 1, 0 when 0 that is the origin and when x is less than 0 then its value is minus 1. So it is the signum function. So all these types of functions are important for competitive examinations. So there the questions in calculus is asked related to these topics. Now two more functions are there which are the logarithmic function. Logarithmic function logarithmic function can be written as fx is equal to log x base a here a must be positive but a should not be equal to 1 and x must be positive so in conditions we see that the graph of the function will be like this It is x axis, it is y axis, and the pattern of the graph will be like this. It is the graph of log x base a when a is greater than 1. Similarly, there is a second form. Second form is also there. It is origin 0, 0, and this point is 1, comma 0. Its second form is also there when the value of a will be between 0 and 1. Suppose the value of a lies between 0 and 1, then the graph will take another shape and that will be like this. 
it is the y is equal to log x base a when a lies between 0 and 1. So all these graphs are important for the competitive examinations. All students must prepare these graphs and their properties. Now one more is there that is exponential function. It is exponential function. It can be written as fx is a power x like this where a is positive. Now its graph is also in two forms. In first type the value of a will be positive. It is for a is greater than 1. a is greater than 1 ke liye graph hoga. that will be like this. It will be the pattern of the graph y is equal to a power x when a is greater than 1. This point is 0, 1, 1 and it is your origin. Similarly, when a lies between 0 and 1, then the graph will take another form and that form will be like this. And this point will be 0, 1. It is 0, 0. So it is the function of both are the graph of a power x. In first case, a is positive greater than 1, and in second, a lies between 0 and 1.